In 2008, after encouraging results from simulations, tank tests and marine prototypes, AW Energy decided the time was right to take the wave roller one step further. The ambitious goal was to create a grid-connected wave energy power plant that could power hundreds of homes in Peniche, Portugal. AW Energy collaborated with local authorities, industrial partners, scientific organizations and a local power company to seek funding from the European Union. In 2009, the SURGE project was awarded funding from the EU Framework Programme 7. The selected deployment site lies in the protected Natura 2000 area of Almagreira. This was possible because environmental impact studies showed no lasting marine disruptions and a low visual impact on the surface. The Portuguese power company Eneolica obtained a commercial grid connection and a subsea cable was installed between the deployment site and a land station. Over in Finland, AW Energy started the construction of three wave roller units. At the same time, another team tested the power takeoff system. Gradually work progressed and the units were sealed off and transported to Portugal. At a local shipyard, the separate wave roller blocks were then mounted into a single hull and a single wave roller panel mounted on each unit. In August 2012, wave roller was towed to the deployment site and submerged into position. Since installation, wave roller has reliably delivered electricity according to expectations, thereby validating the underlying concept. Wave Roller's performance has since been verified independently by a third party, the industry-leading technical advisory body DNVGL. The SURGE project is a remarkable example of how European Union funding plays a key role in bringing renewable energy innovation from R&D stage to demonstration. The next step is commercialization and the dawn of an emerging wave energy industry in Europe. <laughs>